Rubbernecking. It's hard to admit it, but there's something about a car chase or a road accident that brings out the rubberneck in pretty much all of us. But actually, it's extremely dangerous. We'll find out why and how we can stop it. So let's pull over for some answers. Let's get virtual. The term itself comes from the late 1800s, thought largely to refer to gawking tourists turning their heads around like their necks were made of rubber to look at something. But we know it now as a form of distracted driving, where drivers slow down to watch something that's happening outside their car on the road. It seems pretty harmless, especially if everyone else is doing it, but distracted driving, even for a split second, can be deadly. Slowing down to observe a crash can often make us less aware of our surroundings, and according to statistics provided by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, distracted driving in the US in 2019 injured 424,000 people and killed 3,142, with over 500 deaths of others who are not even inside a car. So an accident can often lead to more accidents because of the distracted driving they create. Say you're traveling 55 miles an hour and you look away for five seconds. What you've done there is actually travel 400 meters, roughly the length of a baseball field in your car without looking, which is why distracted driving is so dangerous. Studies have also shown that rubbernecking can even create longer lines of traffic congestion and delays, as well as impacting the speed of traffic in the opposite lane, slowing down to watch and rubberneck, even causing an accident on the other side of the road. How dumb is that? So how do we stop rubbernecking from happening? Well, it's clear we all have some sort of built-in human need to react. Maybe it's morbid curiosity. A University of Florida study found that screens that blocked the view of an accident were effective in reducing rubbernecking, suggesting it's best not to look at all. The California DMV suggests that when driving, we stay focused, pay attention, and expect the unexpected. But whatever you think, slowing down to look at an accident may just be driving us all down a very deadly road indeed.